Hi there, signs of Leo. This is Kim here to do a reading for you guys. And this reading is going to be a next 48 hour. Um, I'm going to pull from the Heavenly Bodies Astrology first. Let's see what we get. And I think what we're going to do is the breakthrough spread today. So for our Leos, Angel Spirit Guides, please join for our Leos, what do we have? Something is process of transforming Pluto. Oh, I have the sun on the bottom. Look at that. Beautiful. Beautiful. Pluto. Okay. What else? Openness. Okay. Well, this is good. Might really be talking about a conjunction. Um, Pluto, Mars, um, a union, merging together, coming together. Taurus, Aries. Possibly coming together for a... Um, Difficult or challenging situation um, with the square. But so the conjunction is like you're going to be in a position where it will be, you'll be able to fix something. You'll be put in the position to be able to fix something, right? All right, so let's, let's pull from this deck. This is the um, Dreams of Gaia. So it's a merging, a coming together. Um, this can be about um, can be about definitely like um, a wartime feel. <laughs> I know I hate to say it like that, but that is what you know. Mars it might have something to do with Tuesday. I mean. We just have a, a few things going on here. So, Leo, let's see. A breakthrough spread. Six spots. The first one is going to be your um, pattern or what, what it is that you need to break through. And it is general, so get what you can from it. And there's different. There's a lot more major arcana with this deck. So, the first thing is your pattern. We'll put that right here. It's all about your perception. Something is um, coming to a completion, too. What's the challenge to it? Oh, your intuition. See, that's one of the extra major arcana. So you got one of the extra. Um, what is your breakthrough? Hmm, six of pentacles. Somebody doing things for you, perhaps. Or you're just, like, dominating something. Um, the fourth card is your power. Nice. Knight of Wands. The fifth card is the outcome. The Nine of Pentacles. And the action, intended action to take. The Counselor. Hmm. Somebody's here to offer some really great advice. Might have something to do, to, truly, it might have something to do with the child energy. I just number one is a, is a new manifestation is what that's representing um, for you too. So let's go ahead and, and kind of dive, dive into this. Um, it's a beautiful, really beautiful reading. So you have kind of like this world energy, but it's, it's, you know, when I see this card, I think of like world view. Um, it's the perception. It is a really um, crazy looking angel on this card too. I love it. Looks um, it looks really dark, but it's interesting because there's there's light around the face with the uh, the white feathers, and then this darkness. I don't know if if it's saying that 
some things aren't exactly how they appear. Some things have, um, or some people have a mask on. So there might be something like that, something in a situation that it's going to be your perception, how you're seeing things. And you'll have to, the challenge, trusting on your intuition. Well, with this intuition, this card just gives me the feel like there is um, something that you have already told yourself about, like, wh whatever, um, what you're perceiving, like, trusting yourself the first time. That's what it is. Trusting yourself the first time. Like what you thought the first time is probably correct. I don't know what this is even pertaining to, but you have success as your breakthrough. So you help me, I help you. Um, that's the kind of uh, attitude, but obviously with this card, Dreams of Gaia has something else in mind and there is a person who's who's like, I'm gonna give this and do this for you and do that for you. So it could be a little bit of spoiling energy too, of being spoiled. That's not a bad thing. So trusting your intuition, your breakthrough is um, allow, the, allow for the give and take. Allow uh, for the I help you, you help me and see how much um, more or how many more instances of paying back or getting paid end up in your life like that will increase and of course you are have you do have an increase you have the hero card also the knight of wands which is um you know it it, it is like um being kind of uh, impulsive but driven by passion um it is what you've got going for you it is that you can pick up and have movement i will say this when you want when you want um you might be that person that's going in and out of people's lives you might be viewed as that with the knight of wands look you, you are viewed as so because maybe it's impulsive but like this person gets what they want um so you just have to make sure that you're holding on because your power is that you're about to go for a really fast ride getting what you want like it's like something just connects and it might even be something that gets healed um like inner child healing or past life healing that just absolutely something clicks something's connected maybe during a conjunction or something like this um you receive help assistance a big win for you the nine of pentacles a big win and the third eye is really pronounced with this nine of pentacles because it's like it's the foresight and the vision too it's your foresight and it's your vision also as well as your intuition and your wisdom all right the counselor could be like it's kind of stating is somebody that comes into your life to help get things moving in the right direction they either help you with proposing something to you an offer um or maybe an actual marriage proposal if it's if you're looking at this as like a romantic thing so this is somebody that will help you and help you get things moving tell me about perception for that candle oh my goodness there's strength <laughs> i thought it was going out and came back up all right tell me about perception Whoa. All right. It is perception. Um, okay, a completion. Possibly needing to reach out to somebody who would be considered an expert at what they do because there's a feeling like somebody could gather more information for you that you need. That's a situation that maybe doesn't make you very happy or it's hard to balance the emotions because there's a lot of emotions in this situation there's definitely an ending or something that you're walking away from putting some hurtful things in the past look at all these swords because you have some kind of truth or clarity or information coming in something was hidden or concealed 
um, or uh, or just flat out a lie with this page of swords in the reverse and that is what's coming to light lying to self um, about something and then here's another um, confirmation for the nine of Pentacles independent self-reliant financial windfall a big gain the three of cups in the reverse is saying that there was there was definitely some things that were said or influenced that were either not true or just very hurtful gossip like it can be that it can be that energy so i would say that this is indicating friends that come and go um and that you'll be taking stock of the reciprocity in in your life and found in your uh, relationships you have nine nine to me it means about it's something that you're letting go of here so that's what it's kind of coming across to me is that there is um maybe even an outcome of entrepreneur um making pretty good money or having a, a big amount of money i feel like don't listen to what um some naysayers are saying or what the adversity is um just persist anyway like you know it, it's it's good if you can just remember if something incites fear in you you know i would steer towards what um what is loving what feels loving to you and if something doesn't feel loving then it's probably there's probably something off about it um so anyway the truth or clarity is what you're putting behind in, behind you in the past and this means that your perception has had a rebirth there is something that you're crystal clear on being able to see now or perceive it is a, it's a, it's like a form of awareness here too might have something to do with a youtube platform spiritual calling a youtube platform oh i also have the spiritual herbalist spiritual healer healing rituals ancient wisdom the signs here are a uh, strong virgo uh, you have taurus 2 sagittarius aquarius scorpio taurus leo pisces and some of those could be up to anything twitter platform spiritual involvements or participations demonologist um entity banishing or removal entity and maybe that's something you're learning about or something like that clear audience clear hearing clear hearing clear audience first step to that Okay, so I feel like that's the first step. I don't know something about a first step, it being a first step. <laughs> Star attunements for high spiritual healing, activation, ascension, and life missions. Star attunements. And, and perhaps this is learning more about the celestial bodies and the movements and the effect of things uh, when, when planets are in conjunct or when they're in opposition to each other and kind of like when when the timing is good sometimes a person isn't necessarily lucky they just are really good with their timing <laughs> so this could be you really figuring that out nice we have a gift 17 a gift I also have 39 community community I have coffin which means that this this is what we're putting um, to an ending to it's a hard ending but we're getting an ending here putting laying something to rest it has to do with what what kind of betrayal this is and walking away from it so I think that that coffin is meaning putting this to rest um, whatever this betrayal is and whatever the lie was about or the um, negative influence what are your thoughts on this 16 also indicating major change and transformation that Mars card says move forward and defend self and Pluto says transform anything else despair coming out of despair obviously because of this um, uh, nine of Pentacles feeling trapped it could be feeling trapped like in a um, 
a situation where it, it's waiting on money. So putting in the effort and using the help that's around you. So that would be part of the breakthrough is using the assistance of others and then helping them. Like I said, that's something, a message that came through is that it's like you'll be getting along really well with others um, and they will help you get to, <laughs> wow, to whatever these nine of pentacles are, which is indicating sudden wealth. Wow. And there you go, official person on the bottom of the deck, 22 master number and 11 master number. So that's what I've got for you, Leos. If you want a private reading, just reach out to me. My email address can be found in the description box below, and they are affordable, I feel. So sending you light and love. Bye-bye.